طيب السلام عليكم uh, how you're going to do the lab simulation here you have the experiment you go to the experiment run the experiment uh, now the aim of the experiment is to find the specific uh, heat of uh, any type of metal suppose I want to find the specific heat of we're gonna check the solid here for uh, let's uh, choose copper and aluminium okay I'll take the copper first um, I can change the mass of the copper I can take 6 gram at the beginning or I can take 10 as, as you want okay temperature always make the temperature high so I am going to heat it up till 200 degree I will go here to next I'll click next liquid always choose water always uh, water and keep it always uh, uh, with the same mass constant mass so I'll keep it always 100 uh, gram mass here I'll keep it always 100 temperature don't play with the temperature keep it at the room temperature what I'm going to do mix I'm going to mix the hot solid with the uh, room temperature water I will have heat exchange which one has the highest temperature the solid it will lose heat and water will start to gain heat I will apply the conservation of energy Q lost equal Q gain to find the heat capacity of what of copper so all of these measurements, I have to record them here in the table that I shared with you in um, uh, MS team. You have to write the mass of the metal, mass of water, we agree it's always 100 gram. All of these, you have to convert them to SI unit. In initial temperature of metal, you have to write it down. Initial temperature of water, you have to write it down. Initial temperature we choose for metal, it was 200 and uh, for water it was 20 degree. Second step, I have to find the equilibrium temperature, the final temperature after I mix them. So I click next and then start, run the experiment. I will wait till uh, till the temperature uh, stop changing okay when it stopped it means we reached the, the, the equilibrium uh, position so this is the final temperature I have to record it down here in the table you have to record it down in the table this is calculation you will do it later on this calculation second same metal but I'm gonna take I'm gonna make another measurement for the same metal so what I'm going to do now reset I will choose solid again, same metal, copper. I can take, um, for example, uh, 38, I can take 40 gram, I can take whatever measurement you want. Just make it twice, make the measurement twice. A temperature, always choose high temperature. Now this time I can choose 160, I can choose the same temperature, 20, okay? Now click next. Uh, liquid always choose water always uh, we agree keep it on 100 don't change keep it 100 and the temperature always keep it at 20 all of these you have to to you have to record them in the table after that you click next start start a mixing and mixing the hot solid with warm temperature water and I'll, I'll wait till it reach the equilibrium You see, it reached the equilibrium. This one, I have to record it again here in the table. I go here, I write in mass that I choose for, for metal. I write in mass of the water. Initial temperature of the uh, metal, it was 200 for water. 20 doesn't change. And T, T final. I want to see your calculation. You can do it for metal one. We, we, we did it for copper. You can do it 
for aluminium, you can do it for silver, but you have to write here the type of metal, okay? At the end, I want to see your calculation. Show sample of your calculation. Most of your mark, I'm, I'm not gonna say all your mark, will depend on your calculation. And I put a table for you. You have to be careful because this table is your very gram. I want you to calculate all the measurement in SI unit, which means joule per kilogram Celsius. Uh, lab report, you have to write lab report. It's like IB lab report, which means the question, the aim of the experiment, uh, the method, everything you included in your report. And you have to tell, tell what tomorrow, Sunday, uh, 20 September to... Uh,